marks the six month anniversary of the eBay Raptor grill install on our 2016 Ford Explorer Sport. So we're gonna talk about that a little bit, um, kind of give my six month review, but first, we gotta go get her cleaned up. explore through the car wash uh, normally we wash our cars by hand but uh, this kind of will give you guys an idea of I guess the durability of the grill it can hold up to a car wash so I want to do that just to um, kind of add that to the review that it can hold up and you know withstand that kind of stuff so we are headed back to the house and we will talk about this some more when we get there. All right, so we've made it back to the house and as expected, the car wash didn't do so great. Nothing beats a hand wash, but it is what it is, I wanted to clean it up. So to go back and talk about um, the grill itself, uh, I did order a gloss black grill and did receive the matte black grill, uh, which I ended up liking better and in my previous video I mentioned that so if you haven't seen that video go back and check that out I'll put a card right up here and uh, watch that and you'll be able to see the installation of the grill it's not too bad um, the only thing I can say that I that I didn't like or don't like about the grill is that there's no boss for the outside air temperature sensor um, there is the the tang in there uh for the sensor to sit in but it also takes a screw and it the boss wasn't there so i don't know it is what it is i use a tie wrap and um we've had no problems with it so anyway without further ado i'm going to show you the grill so you can see what it looks like and um i'll talk about it all right so hopefully, hopefully you guys can see this um i got the light on out here in the garage but it is still kind of dark but uh, I'm going to give you a close-up of the grill. It still looks good in my opinion. One of my worries with it was that it may fade. It is the matte finish, so it's not painted. Well, I guess it's painted a matte black, or maybe that's the color of the plastic. I don't know. But that was one of my worries, um, that it would fade. But as you can see, you know, it still matches the other outside trim so it still looks good um, I'll turn on the or I'll unlock it so you can see the, the lights turn on the lights still work that was kind of another worry that over time maybe the the lights would burn out the LEDs but so far they're still working nice and bright like they should be and no issues with the grill. And like I said earlier, this is six months. Actually, if you go by the date, like the day, today is actually the sixth month point. So I 
I wanted to do this review. I know a lot of you guys had questions about it and uh, just wanted to show you how it's holding up. Uh, in my previous video, I believe I put in the description that I paid $125 for it. And since it wasn't gloss black, you know, I contacted the seller and they actually gave me a partial refund which I think was like 35 bucks. So I ended up paying less than a hundred bucks for the grill. And actually I do like the matte black much better. As you can see, it blends with the, uh, the other outside trim really well. I like it. So I know some other questions were, or another question was, you know, how did I wire it up? Um, I wired it into the driver's side parking light circuit. Um, I don't remember the wire colors. Um, that was another question, but I just used a test light, found the positive wire for when you turn the parking lights on, found the positive wire and just tied into that and then ran aground to the chassis. So let me pop the hood and we'll look at the top part of the grill so you can see that. Okay, so here's the top part of the grill. You can see where it bolts up just like factory. I know I didn't show a lot of this in uh, my installation video, but that one was long and I actually had to put the footage in fast motion. It was a really long video. But that's the top of it. Still in good shape. No, no cracks, no anything like that. You know, splits in the plastic, anything. Um, it's holding up rather well. Well, there it is. Six months, and in my opinion, still looks great. Like I said, the finish is holding up well. I was really worried about that. So if anybody was thinking about getting this grill and was worried about longevity, um, it's held up for six months. And my wife does drive this every day, so it sees its share of dirt, uh, rocks, sand, whatever, bugs, you know daily driver stuff so yeah i think it's held up really well so if you have any other questions on the grill want to know anything about it just let me know comment down below uh you can also hit me up on instagram pony1992 underscore s550 and i will get back to you but as you can see it looks great it's held up well so, hope you liked this video. If you did, hit the like button. If you haven't subscribed, please do that, and we'll see you on the next one.